All right, so this is a suggestion via Discord. The name of the video is You Better Not Waste My Time. Uh, this is coming from the artist or group N Dubs. Let's check it out. Definitely feels like hip hop, something whimsical, almost NF esque. Boasting about my verses I'm speaking about the way I run around Snatching purses For every meaning as a purpose Just for kind of I mean, that wasn't a purse You definitely took that man's wallet But all right I'm speaking about the way I run around Snatching purses For every meaning as a purpose Just for kind of I went to school It don't mean that I can't be perfect But screaming out loud We's addicted to money Like two fingers tapping on Wherever there's a vein And believe me, yeah, we're proud Cause life is getting sicker by the day And therefore we'll always stick around So now you see the size of me You would have think how many harm No, 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 no. That's a clown car, bro. Guys, I think his overall, uh, his cadence and delivery is solid, guys. Uh, definitely a UK rapper, but he's not, like, uh, borrowing at all from anyone from the UK. He seems to be uh, most likely an artist that was focused on a lot of, like, maybe East Coast or maybe... Hmm, north midwest style of hip-hop it feels kind of like that um but with like uk influences All right, the um the chorus is great, guys. I'm gonna go ahead and guess probably uh, based off of a lot of what I'm seeing here. I see Averex jacket. Um, there's a woman in white dancing like she's in a Nelly music video. So I'm gonna go, go ahead and guess 2007, eight maybe. You I mean, these people are not obviously there for you. If, if you have to mention money and then they'll instantly come, then I, then I hear for you, bro. Only time you ever okay, so is N Dubs like a group? Just 13. All right, so definitely uh, the fake friends. That's what this is about. It seems like it, at least. So, so the first artist themselves, um, their overall delivery and how they delivered it itself, um, in terms of the lyrics itself, actually, um, was all about fake friends. And, and it seems like she's now jumping into the same kind of topic. Bro, bro, why are you randomly feeding women in jacuzzis fruit? I think that they're just following basically the overall hip hop aesthetic of the time, most likely. Like the visuals itself, like they're trying to just make it as hip hop as humanly possible with scantily clad women. And, and I've never seen a fruit thing, but either way, guys, I mean, listen, I understand for the time it was, uh, this was what we grew up with. Th this is probably my late, my late teens, most likely is what this feels like. I 
my verse in the class till it was home time. Yeah. I never used to pay attention in school. Was nope. playing penny up the wall or in detention with fools. That's yeah. why most of teachers used to doubt me. They used to What's interesting, uh, really quickly, so... Each of the rappers definitely are from the UK, guys. But she did not sound at all like she was from the UK. Uh, maybe she's like a transplant. I say I wouldn't make it in my music just to see me get rowdy. So I could switch in a classroom for an excuse to kick me out. I wonder why I'm bunking all my lessons in the bath. Now I'm starving, hungry, working hard for this superstardom life. Been kind of hard for me to try and make it right. And it's hard to decide whether I should leave behind all my peeps in this life. To move forward and see what I find. This life is leads like a gas baby being born addicted to Christ. So much evil and Yeah, guys, I mean, they sound great. <laughs> that, that, like, for example, um, I'm not sure that it, it aged extremely well because obviously things are just so drastically different now in terms of uh, the genre of hip hop. But I do think for the time that this came out, I'm guessing again, um, the late 2000s, most likely, right? Uh, I'm guessing for the time that this came out, I think that this, this definitely stood against a lot that was out there. Um, it sounds great. It doesn't. It doesn't feel like a uh, like a project that didn't go far. If that makes any sense, it felt like something that probably moved uh, a bit, um, even if it was just locally. I think everyone heard it, guys. That's that's the type of kind of um, that's the vibe I get off of this song. <laughs> Yeah, guys, I definitely probably would have cut a little bit of the last, uh, like the ending chorus itself, probably just brought it down to about four bars, maybe. Um, or how about this? Keep the beat, but just keep the overall, like the, the verbal hook cut down slightly to about four bars. Um, I think that probably would have um, been dope, guys. All right. Um, but listen, overall, the project itself is great. No complaints here. Um, again, it's definitely a nostalgic sounding thing. It reminds me of my my late teens. That's This is what we, guys, this is how we acted. This is what we did. This is how we looked with the hats and, and you know, the fake chains and all these, all this stuff. This is what we did. If you didn't know. Right? Now, this is a, an amazing nostalgic piece of, of going down memory lane um, from across the pond, obviously. Right? Um, but all right, listen, you guys all have an absolutely amazing day. Enjoy your day thoroughly. Mm -hmm.